slower than that <laughs> just trying to be gentle so I didn't think I was gonna make a video of this but you know what let's make a video of this we're removing this little oak she's got a couple little plants in there we're removing that little madrone and that cedar and we're removing this pine in a second I'll show you how we've rigged up this pine to rig it out whole Maybe we'll let Adam explain that. Talk, talk us through the process. Let him talk us through the process. Maybe tell us about the hiccups that were involved. Show up, well, <laughs> he'll show you the hiccups that were invo involved. <laughs> Jeff's got this oak that's leaning over, sitting on a little hinge. He's got it all the way down, bucked up to the trigger. So now we'll go ahead and record like him. Ready for the money moves? Releasing what? the trigger here. There it is. There it is. Nice work, Jeff. Went tracking just like we thought it would. Take that. We'll cut it up over here. I'll take that. We're gonna carry these like this in manageable lengths. We're gonna set them next to the wood storage and then we'll cut them into 16s over here because I ain't trying to make a thousand trips. Jeff ain't trying to make a thousand trips. Okay, so we're removing this pine. We threw a line up into the pine and choked it off. And then we throw another line up into the oak and pull the other end of the line up over a crotch on the oak down to a porter wrap. And that's where we hold all of our friction because that would be too uh, heavy to hold just on a rope itself. Now, Jeff will cut it, and Adam will pull it out into the goalie. Okay. <laughs> Slice the roux, huh? <laughs> <laughs> And see how, see how like non-dynamic that is? It didn't, it's not breaking any limbs off the other furs. Hey Jeff!
So that's that. Get a rigging line set, make a couple cuts, pull it out, and then we'll probably winch it into the chipper hole. Hey guys, we got to give Jeff my uh, 201. I'm still running this because my 200 still, I haven't even messed with it. I'm just tired of it right now. But anyways, uh, Jeff, you want to go ahead and start your saw? Can we hear what it's doing? Seems like it wants to start. Issue. What's wrong with Jeff's saw? All right, let's get him the 201 and then uh, we'll get him the camera and we'll rig this little cedar out. All right, now that Jeff's got a saw that rips with a bindy bar, of course, my bar is bent or something, which is a bummer because it's my favorite bar. It's the made for this bar. <laughs> Don't listen to Jeff <laughs> when it comes to that. I'm ready for a uh, rope. Anyways, he's making steady progress. He's ready for a rope. I'll be the one to give it to him. Tie on. This is what I'll use to tie it on. I think it's called a sheet bend. It goes like this goes up like that but then I actually do it like that so for the climber when they get it they can go like this pull it out and it's good to go so I go like that right here pull a little bite through and then choke it down so hi right, Jeff you can see the cedar Jeff's ready he's gonna stay up there and we're going to rig it out hole and lay it down right there. Cut a tiny bit off real quick. Okay. Lay down. We'll go ahead and buck it up and haul it out that way. Okay, can I buck really fast? Okay, I'm bucking really fast.
she bucked. Now we gotta carry her out. So that's good. All right, Jeff's about to take his top out or other branch out. And the way he's gonna have to do it is without hurting that bush and that fern. So we've got a log sitting there and another log sitting here. I'll have to kind of pop it out and then probably push the butt over. Yeah, I'll try to get my hands on it. Hopefully I have time to hang my saw up. Somebody put my carabiner on me wrong, so it's hard to hang up one-handed. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't put it on. <laughs> Damien did that for you. I know, I, I can tell. See if we can get, see if we can get a, uh, a view of that action of him pushing the butt out, huh? Nice! Nice, Jeff! So yeah, you want to do it like that. <laughs> From now on, or just on my next try? Whatever, you know, just practice it. We have to practice that move. I'm hoping that within a year or two, I can do it right. So, Zoppo's on. That butt there would at least crush that plant. It got far enough out to not crush the fern. And uh, we don't want to hurt this stuff either. So, that looks, that looks almost perfect. Almost. Adam, you're in my way. You're in my way, Adam. I'm trying to record. I'm trying to record, Adam. <laughs> Since it's sloping, taking this log and propped him underneath this, which actually increases the angle. So it's actually barely downhill now. So if the log lands there, it'll want to slope to the uphill surface rather than downhill into this deck. 